former Good Morning Britain presenter Piers Morgan has taken to Twitter to question how Prime Minister Boris Johnson can survive in his role in government after being fined by police for breaking lockdown laws by attending parties. The TV broadcaster, 56, took to the microblogging site to share his thoughts on the news which was confirmed earlier today by Metropolitan Police. In view of his 7.9 million followers, the uncensored talk show star claimed it is a very serious moment for the Prime Minister. Piers wrote, I'm struggling to see how Boris Johnson can survive becoming the first serving British Prime Minister to be found guilty of breaking the law. Especially when it was a law he created to stop the rest of us doing what he then did. In a previous tweet, the star had questioned how the Prime Minister could survive the fine politically. Piers Bend, how does a serving Prime Minister survive being fined by police for breaking laws that he enforced on the rest of the country? He clearly misled Parliament at best, deliberately lied to Parliament at worst. Very serious moment for Boris Johnson, he added. In a later tweet, Piers wrote, Now is not the time to get rid of a Prime Minister who broke his own laws and lied to Parliament. He penned while mulling over the statement. As well as Boris being fined, the PM's wife Carrie Johnson and the Chancellor Rishi Sunak were also handed fixed penalty notices by police. Officials had confirmed they had received notifications of the fines from the Met following an investigation into illegal parties held by Downing Street during Covid lockdowns. The three were reported to be at the same gathering for the Prime Minister's birthday in June 2020, however a spokesperson for them said they were not told which event the fines were in relation to. In response to the news, Labour leader Sir Keir Starmer and Scotland's First Minister Nicola Sturgeon have called for the Prime Minister and the Chancellor to resign. It comes as the Met is investigating breaches of lockdown laws at 12 gatherings at Downing Street and Whitehall. Over 50 fines have been handed out so far, it has been reported. Following Piers' tweets, his followers soon took to the comments to weigh in on the matter. At Steve Barron 5 commented, Are people still bothered with this? At RNZZ99 agreed, adding, I think only a noisy minority of people are interested in this now. At Aspen underscore 394 penned, just ignore what everyone says and carry on. A fine by the police won't be the bomb that broke the armor. At Blues85 wrote, we both know this changes nothing, surely we've learned this about them by now. Agreeing, at Pains 86 added, I have a sneaky suspicion he might just get away with it. <laughs>